Hi, boys and girls. This is Mrs. Engel. Today, we're going to read this book called My Friend Isabel by Eliza Walzo. My Friend Isabel. My name is Charlie. This is my friend Isabel. Even though we are the same age, we are different. I am tall. Isabel is short. I run fast. Isabel takes her time. I carry around a black and white kitty and Isabel carries around a doll named Meg. I know a lot of words. Isabel's words are sometimes hard for me to understand. Mommy says that differences are what make the world so great. I would have to agree with that, right? I know sometimes I say words that sound a little funny. That's because of my accent. Every Friday, Isabel and I play together. We dance to Stevie Wonder. Isabel teaches me how to twirl. We pretend to go shopping for grapes at the store. We cry when one of us forgets to share. Sometimes that happens too. We drink apple juice and eat Cheerios at the little red table and cheers. Cheers, they say. We bring our sippy cups together to say cheers. Kitty and Meg say cheers too. Cheers, cheers. We go down the big slide at the park. We both like to do it ourselves. We hold hands. Isabel has soft hands. Mommy's right. Life is more fun with friends like Isabel. This is a picture of Isabel, the real Isabel. Isabel is a child with Down syndrome. This means she doesn't look or think quite like Charlie does. Isabel can do many things that Charlie can do, but sometimes it takes her a little longer to do them. Through their friendship, Charlie and Isabel are doing their small part to make the world a more tolerant place. Remember this word, tolerant, right? We can tolerate, we can be patient and kind and nice to others that might not look like us, might not speak like us, might even have accents like I do because I was born in Mexico and English is my second language. But I try really hard to speak just like you. So be patient if I sometimes mispronounce a word, right? We need to be nice and kind to everyone. I hope you enjoyed this lovely book about our little friend, Isabel. Bye-bye now.